Fighters behind the lines in three, two, one, go. Blue Alliance throw about 40, 27 scores quickly, delivering its game piece, and then attempts to climb on two and does dock and engage with the Blue Alliance charge station. RoboCats have done the same. At the end of our opening period, the Red Alliance out in front, 34 to 25. Red Alliance robots on the move, all three of them with game pieces in their possession. And they're able to deliver 40-50, the first to release and back away. Now reaches down to grab another cube from the floor. 40-27 for the Blue Alliance has to make its way all the way across the field where it joins up with the Astro Circuits who are already there at the substation trying to take on more game pieces. 40-27, knockout. Swings and is able to connect. In the meantime, it's the RoboCats on the move for the Red Alliance. Cone in their possession, swerve drive, kicking. Trying to place another cone and they do so on the high row. Five more points for the Red Alliance. They now lead 60 to 45. Blue Alliance trying to turn it on now. On defense for the Blue Alliance, 82-43. Trying to set up a defensive perimeter. Red Alliance robot 40-50 comes in contact with 82-43. They're inside the Red Alliance loading zone. Those foul points will be awarded to the Red Alliance. Red Alliance now with 82 points. Coming up on the 32nd mark. 30 seconds. 30 seconds remaining. Red Alliance is in front, but the Blue Alliance has closed the gap. They are within 10. Shoving match now. 117 trying to take on 82-43. It releases and then makes its way to the Red Alliance charge station. Robots now on top of each other as they try to get there. Blue Alliance has two robots docked and engaged. Three seconds, two seconds, one second. That's it. This one is over. Red Alliance. Red Alliance moved into the end game with a lead and they were able to carry that through despite the technical challenges they had there in the closing seconds. Final score, 103 to 96. All three teams.